Remember how Irving got three slugs in the belly? How it happened outside the frontier deli? How he lived by his gun and died by his gun? Well, no one knew Fat Irving had a son named Seymour. Tall, slim Seymour. Tall, slim, excellent-looking Seymour. Son of the 142nd fastest gun in the West. He had steely eyes and stood six foot four. When he walked in the bar, he filled the door. He had a gun in one hand, and the folks would stare, cause in his other hand, he had a teddy bear. Seymour, tall sissy Seymour, tall, excellent looking sissy Seymour. Son of the 142nd fastest gun in the West. Seymour was dressed in boots magenta by his mother, Esther, a dance hall yenta. She had one goal and he never mocked her. She dreamed he'd marry a lady doctor. Seymour, mama's boy Seymour, excellent looking big baby Seymour. Son of the 142nd fastest gun in the West. One day Seymour rode into town, Billy the Kid was waiting to shoot him down. Seymour disguised himself in a dress and bustle, and rode out of town as Lillian Russell. Seymour, side saddle Seymour, tall, really excellent looking Seymour. Son of the 142nd fastest gun in the West. But then Seymour made Bad Max a dare. There stood Seymour, one hand on his gun and one on his teddy bear. But Bad Max shot Seymour down in the high noon sun. Stupid Seymour had drawn his teddy and hugged his gun. Seymour, mortally wounded Seymour, not so excellent looking Seymour, dead, dumb, dumb Seymour. Truly the son of the 142nd fastest gun in the West.